Hi, I'm Suma Ravik with Keller Williams Realty Diversified Suma Ravik and Associates. Today, we're going to talk about twin homes versus a duplex and what, what does that mean, buying a twin home? Stay tuned. So twin homes, what are they? There, is, there are a lot of them in the Driftless Cooley region and there's a lot of new twin homes. And I'm sure all of you know about duplexes, duplexes where you would own both sides and duplexes actually share the lot. With twin homes though, you actually own one side and you have your own lot parcel. So you have your own parcel number, you pay taxes on that one side. There are pros and cons to twin homes. Um, the pros are one, uh, twin home, uh, being a twin home owner can be amazing because as a first time home buyer, you can usually get into uh, an affordable house as a twin home instead of buying a single family detached where it usually would cost you more. So that's a pro. Second is that you, um, you would definitely save money on your heating because there's a shared wall in a twin home. So you own three walls instead of four, and so that would help with your heating costs. Thirdly, a lot of times twin homes are not taxed as high as single family detached homes. And this is really good too for um, you to save money. So again, it can be a really good first time home buyer or even if you're downsizing, uh, it, it can be a really good purchase for you. And, um, and then the cons. So there's a few cons. Some people say, well, um, what happens if my neighbor is, is loud? And obviously you would need to check that out and make sure that the builder has put in a really good uh, firewall and um, in the wall you wouldn't be able to hear neighbors. And a lot of twin homes that are built today are like that, so they're soundproof. And secondly, maybe you have a neighbor who is not upkeeping their yard. That can be a con, but yet you would still have that issue if you bought a single family home. A lot of times, maybe you have a neighbor who's not keeping up their yard as well as you, you are in your standards. So those are pretty much the pros and cons. Another con is that with twin homes, um, a lot of times the value, they don't increase in value as much as the single family detached. So with a single family detached, prices may be a little bit higher than a twin home. But there again, that's where it's a really good investment, especially as a first time home buyer. Um, when I was 23 years old, I bought, uh, that was my first home was a twin home. It was a split level and it served me and my husband very, very well and helped us build a little bit of equity and then especially new construction. Then we were able to go buy another new construction, single family detached home. So I really encourage you to check out these uh, twin homes in the community. There's a development on the south side of La Crosse actually it called Waterview Subdivision. And if you have any questions about them or anything else that we can help you out with all real estate related, my number is 608-498-6076.